So what was your favorite scene to shoot from this season? Oh, the positivity party. I just thought that was such a great idea, and I loved my costume. I loved my wig. It was great. Can you, There's one other that I really liked, but I can't mention it. Can you go into what your costume and, and wig looks like? I wanted to be a surprise. I really wanted to be a surprise. I will give you wig. So you know there's a wig, but that's that's it. Speaking of costumes, Halloween's coming up. Do you like to dress up? Do you know what you're dressing up as? I don't really. I did a movie last year on Halloween Day, and I was like an 800-year-old man, and I kept the makeup on that night, and it was great. But I'm not really good at going out and pulling together some witty, crazy costume and parading around all night, because it's work. You kind of have to be in character all night long, and that's no fun. And you're already in character all day, so. Day long, so Halloween, I just want to sit home and eat sushi and watch a movie, you know? Uh, what were your, some of your favorite guest stars from this season? Uh, Frankie Muniz, I thought was great. Busy Phillips was amazing and so sweet. Um, who else? Oh, Ben Lawson. Oh my God, he's hot and he's funny. It was ridiculous. Mark Paul Gossler too, right, from Saved by the Bell? Yeah, he was great. I wasn't there that day, unfortunately, but yeah, he was great. Who would be some dream guest stars that you would love to have on the show? Oh, Jennifer Lewis. Kim Fields. Uh, I wanted Sherman Hemsley to play my father so badly, but he's gone, unfortunately. Um, Ron Glass would be great. You, as you can see, I love the 70s and 80s sitcom stars. Like, those are my peeps. The Be in Apartment 23 is about this, you know, horrible roommate from hell. So do you have any horrible roommate stories you can share? Whew, I had a roommate who stole and sold all of my belongings on the streets of New York to buy drugs. I came home to an empty apartment and a roommate sitting there going, I don't know what happened. And I found out he had sold all of my stuff. Pretty much sounds like Chloe, like one of her scams. <laughs> like Chloe, yeah. It's awful. I've had a lot of bad roommates though. I mean, it, it's been, I had a roommate who pounded on my door at five o'clock in the morning saying she needed to talk. You know, like, you know, it's been really, it's why I live alone now. <laughs> Um, if you could be roommates with anybody in the entertainment industry for a week, let's say, who would it be? Queen Latifah. <laughs> and why her? I just think we would have fun. She would sit around freestyling, you know. I don't know, we would cook, you know what I mean? Wouldn't be, it would be lovely.